Gucci aka Dicky my sister and I am back with another video this video is going to kick off our entrepreneur series called boss babe series and the reason why I chose to name the series boss babe is because for one my business which is a mink lash slash lip gloss lip scrub bougie bangles pretty much anything that makes a girl smile is called Barbie Babes LLC and I call myself Boss Babe. So I was like, let me just start a series so I can help girls get their business up and running because like I had so many misconceptions about starting a business. I thought it was just so hard. Like, yes, it can be hard, but if you just break down every aspect of building a business into smaller parts, you're gonna get it all done. So of course, before we get started, Make sure you guys watch my previous videos. I dropped the story time last week. I dropped three other videos. Girl, it's been a little minute. I asked my followers, you know, what is something challenging or what is something that is stopping you from making your own business? And one of my followers on Instagram said, make your own logo and, you know, getting money for your business. This episode is going to be all about making your own logo having a cute logo is very very significant because your logo is kind of like your first encounter that customers have when they see your business your logo needs to be popping and it needs to describe what your business is or what's the theme of your business like even though my business i sell a whole bunch of different things you know of course my logo i don't have lashes right here bougie bang right here lip gloss right here i don't have all that i just have a simple logo but i have a logo that's versatile that's why i didn't go with the name lash by this or blank cosmetics because i knew i was gonna have morning cosmetics so i chose a name and a logo that's versatile so people be like oh what she sell you know what i'm saying i made it cute i made it girly so you know it's for girls now when people see my logo they're like girl who made your logo your logo so cute and let me see something i made my logo i made it myself because for one i contacted different businesses you know people who made logos and they was quoting me prices like two and three hundred dollars and six, when you are a small business owner, you need to be trying to save as much coins as possible so you can invest in your products. And going broke on a logo is not what's up. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to knock people hustles if you made logos. But I was not about to pay $300 for a generic logo that wasn't gonna be my vision. So if I really know what my vision is, how about I portray my vision and put it into reality myself because nobody's going to be able to understand my vision 100% like me. Like, yes, I can tell the person, I want this, I want this, I want this, but it's not going to be everything in my head. And sometimes, you know, your vision might be off and they could possibly, you know, make it even better. I did a really good job on mine. Like, I'm really impressed with mine. And it's not even that, you know, busy. Like, I did a simple logo, but... It was very, very creative. It was very, you know, simple. Um, and it was me, it was my vision because I did it myself. So I am going to tell you the app that a lot of people use when they make logos. So if you wanna know this app, you better not click out this video because I'm about to tell you what the app is. The app is called Canva. It's like Canvas without the S. It's called Canva. And the app is free to download, but the app is $13.99, okay? It's $13.99 a month. I'm just gonna go ahead and put it out there. Now they do give you a seven day free trial. So if you really, really wanna get smart, how about you hurry up and make that logo in seven days, download that mug and delete the app and just go on about your business? Because my friend did it, you know what I'm saying? She got the app and she dipped out, so sweet sometimes you have to do what you gotta do you know what i'm trying to say so yeah so i hope this video teaches you how to make your own logo so yeah so let's go ahead and get into this video so hi babes before we begin i wanted to show you all my logo that i created for my business barbie Bays llc and i'm going to show you all how to make your own logo on a budget so stay tuned so the app I said before is called Canva. So go ahead and download it. So 
So Canva has a lot of options. It lets you customize your own Instagram posts, Instagram stories, YouTube channel banners, also your own flyers. They even have pre-made logos that you can use and kind of tweak it to make it to your own if you're not comfortable starting from scratch. Canva has so many options. I use Canva on a daily basis for my business page. So it is a very good investment. Again, it's only $13.99 a month. So let's go ahead and get started. Of course, we're gonna start from scratch and we're gonna create our own fake business and let's just say we are selling lashes so let's start off by picking a name and the name we're gonna pick is called lashes galore now that you have your name let's go ahead and choose a cute font of course okay so now that we have our font now let's go ahead and center our name just so it can be in the middle you don't want it off center and of course they give you the little lines it's going to be red it's going to show up whenever it's right dead in the center now let's pick some designs because we don't just want a name we want something that's going to make our logo pop of course so i'm trying to see if i can find some lashes maybe to put on there Let's just see how it's going to look. They have so many pictures. Now, this is really cute. But I did see a design that I really, really liked. And I passed by it. And I'm just going to see if I can find it again. Yes, this is exactly what I like. It is a box of lashes. It is so cute. And your customers are definitely going to know what you sell just by looking at your logo. All right. Our logo is almost done, but I feel like we need to pick something that's going to tie it all together. So I decided to look up a circle and voila, it is so cute and simple. Like I am in love. So once you are satisfied with your logo, you want to go ahead and save your logo so it can be already in the app and it can also be in your camera roll. So you want to save your logo as a regular image and you also want to save your logo with transparency. Now that you saved, let's go to your camera roll, make sure it's there. And look, it is already there. So I'm gonna show you what your transparency logo is gonna look like. And of course, since our font was black, it's going to look like it's all black. But once you print it out and put it on something that's color, it's gonna show up quite well or even on a white background. But if you wanna put your logo on something that is black, change your font to white, and it's gonna definitely show up like this. So this is pretty much all you have to do. I hope you guys learned something. make your own logo or if you ever tell a friend who is starting their business you, know, you might be able to show them how to make their own logo i am definitely going to be back with more videos like this every week i want to be able to teach you guys different aspects of having a business like the little small things and i want you guys to be able to be your own boss be able to do your own thing so i'm so glad you guys stay tuned and watch my video i'm gonna be back next week so bougie out this thing bye you guys be back in another video shortly. I'm not going to tell you when, but just know you're going to get another video next week. So, bye, guys.